Hey, this is Jeff. If you're like me and you're trying to install an alpha closet system by yourself, there comes a time when you have to drill three ancient holes for these, uh, these kind of anchors for the top rail for the alpha. So this is a, um, an alpha wall anchor. It's got the screw in there. And so this dark, dark plastic piece down there is like sort of the end cap that it screws into. And so after you've stuck this in the wall and you've got the railing on and you tighten this up, then this plastic part starts to, it's, it's really flexible here. It starts to contract and it really grips. Um, it, it bunches up at the, you know, at the, at the back of it and also kind of bunches up in the middle here too. So it kind of really grips, grips into the wall and you got like five or six of those and you can, you know, you know, hang 20, a couple hundred pounds on that. So, um, it's really, uh, seems like a very effective system. Although it's pretty much of a bear to install. It says to remove the screw from the anchor, ensuring the gray insert stays in place. Okay. First you have to drill the hole and then remove the screw from the white anchor, which means that you unscrew it and you take it out of this. And then you're supposed to tap the anchor into the 3 8 inch hole. And it'll look like something like this after you've, you've tapped it in. So, And this is a pretty flexible piece of plastic. So if you're like me and you're trying to tap this in, it just doesn't go in. It just kind of, you know, it bends. It, it, um, sometimes I've break, broken these things. Here's the trick. After you've unscrewed that screw, stick that screw back in there. And I'm going to try to do this one-handed, but... And then you use... Use it, use it to tap, tap in the anchor. And it might get, it might get a little bit jammed on there, but you just keep going, tapping in very gently because there's a, there's a plastic uh, at the at the end of this thing, so you don't want to strip it. Okay, so I did it. It kind of the, that plastic end cap finally went went through the drywall in the back, right? So now what you got to do is you have to, you have to unscrew this out of there. There. Okay, good. Unscrew this out of there, and then you see how it's uh, sticking out a little bit? Then you just tap that sucker in there. And that's how you do it. You kind of don't follow the instructions, which I, I always love doing.